building better roads. Any news from Lacey Hayes? Sorry, sir. We're having a hard time reaching anyone. That storm probably... Damn. Must be one hell of a hurricane to cut us from the whole planet. Chief Administrator, I'm showing a weight discrepancy on the Bentonville's manifest. They just asked for a takeoff accreditation, but half the shipment is still at dock. Half, you say? Well, we just earned a bonus. I'll allow them to take off right away. Protocol dictates... How many times? Company protocol doesn't mean anything out here. What works, works. And we're already behind schedule. Director Price? Isn't here. And if I do recall correctly, Deputy Administrator Hayes, your shift ended half an hour ago. So get the hell off my command deck and let me do my job. I don't care what McDonald says, something is wrong here. I can monitor the cargo bay camera's security feed just as well from my office. Thank you, Daniel. 
but no. I'm just having one of those days, you know? Another argument with Administrator McDonald. How did you guess? I may be synthetic, but I'm not lying. Are you sure I can't be of assistance? No. It's my problem, and I'll take care of it. I just need to reach my office. Of course. But I'm afraid this corridor is closed due to maintenance. You'll need to detour through the cafeteria. I heard no one's picking up on the planet. Not even Jackson's Landing. Really? I have a friend there. Don't often see you in here, Administrator Hayes. Are you lost? Do you need me to show you to your room? Last I checked, you couldn't find your own ass with both hands. I'll pass. Supply Shuttle Bentonville, secure for launch. All crews, this is your two-minute warning. Shit. Need to hurry. Welcome, Administrator Hayes. Take a closer look. Where's Chief Durant? Settling the labor dispute on a rally. Then you'll have to do. Gather security team and come with me. <laughs> Not a chance. McDonald just linked in. Told us you'd be stirring up trouble. Again. I ain't getting involved. Take it up with him. Thanks for nothing. Those fucking storage hoppers in base. Supply shuttle Bentonville is cleared for launch. Remember, all unauthorized breaks taken by non-officer grades will automatically be deducted from leave allowance. Going to be all right. Cargo Bay. These things came out of. Stay with me. Stay. God damn it. Keep it together. You need to see what's in there. Better take his pistol. Whatever's in there doesn't know I can't aim for shit. That's the Bentonville. What were they holding in these things? No. 
make that thing run loose. I need to lock this damn door. There's a welder back there. Time to get it sealed up. Whatever that thing is, can't chew its way through a door. What are you talking about? The dock crew and cargo bay four are dead. Dead? That's not funny. Something got loose and killed. Power failure. Power failure. Engaging emergency generators. What just happened? Otago. This is Administrator Hayes. There's some kind of infestation aboard. Otago, you have to intercept the Benhamville before it leaves the system. Can you hear me, Otago? Please copy. Is everything all right? Please copy. Damn it! Comms, you're down. I can't fix him from here. I need to get to the comms room. Room. Lewis, answer me, damn it! Go away! You're drawn right to us. Open the damn door! No way! It's staying locked to keep those things out! You think that'll help? They're in the vents. Vents? <laughs> Shit! Lewis! Lewis! Alert. Alert. Station integrity compromised. Manning? It's out there. It's waiting for me. Manning, you can't stay here. No, no, I can't see me here. Go away, go away! Okay, just keep your head down, right? <sighs>
administrator. It appears that these creatures have destroyed our communication system. Why would they do that? They're animals. Sorry, I have no idea. I wish I could help you further. Shit, the Bentonville. I need to stop that ship. Daniel, our planetary quarantine protocols, they're still operational, aren't they? I do believe so, Deputy Administrator. What do I do? Those things have to come from the planet. If even one gets off-world... No, there's no choice. I can stop them. Deputy Administrator, you're only following the Wayland yutani containment procedures. The Cerberus protocol was specifically designed for a situation like this. What you're doing is only right. Right. Yes. Ships detected. USS Otago, Bentonville, Baldwin. Will be caught in the high orbit interdiction radius. Please confirm command. I am so sorry. Cerberus protocol activated. Purging contaminant vectors. Stand by. Stand by.
long career. Diego. Well, that's just great. I'm Sergeant Harper, USCN. You? Hey, he's, uh, Dep Deputy Administrator. You're from the Otago? Yeah. What the hell was that thing? It was... Everyone's dead. It was on one of the cargo shuttles. All right, people. We're falling back to the dropship. Hunslet, we're rolling to you. Copy. Cerberus protocol in effect. What the fuck is a Cerberus protocol? No clue. Just keep it moving and watch those corners. It's planetary quarantine. Nothing in, nothing out. Sounds like a real party. You okay, Sarge? Eyes ahead. Something's coming. Harper? We've got movement. <sighs> Manny? Where are you going? It's not safe here! It's not! Damn straight, but we'll get you out. No, you don't understand! It's here! It's here! <laughs> Light it up! Eyes up! That thing's still out there! Take him out! Use the grenade! Eat them! Squirrely bastards, ain't they? We need that elevator! Punch it! Pressing fire and check your targets! Getting closer! Closer! Wait for my order! Steady! Steady! It's not safe. The protocols are clear. Nothing in, nothing out. I'm sorry, Administrator Hayes. Stand down! Quarantine breach in progress. Deadly force authorized. Bring it down! What the hell was that? I... I don't know. I've never even heard Daniel raise his voice. Sit. Tense, man. Creepy little fuckers. Blood is some kind of acid. 
fuck? What kind of blood type is that? Keep your distance, Marines. Latimer, you fit to move? I'm not dying here. All right, let's get off this damn station. We need Latimer Mobile ASAP. I'll break open the med kit. Shit! Ugh. Ah! Ruiz, you're making it worse! Bish, don't be such a baby. There you go. You ain't pretty, but that ship sailed long ago. Gee, thanks. Shit, they're in the wall! They're too close! Switch to sidearms! Those things are handy for close encounters. For a migraine. Seriously, Sarge? What's up with you? Move! No! We're in danger! Ah! Sergeant Harper, pull it together! We have to leave! Yeah, yeah, I heard you! Corporal Hutzler, get your ass down here! Hot evac! All right, all right. Air Hunslet inbound. Have your boarding passes ready. There's no rush. It's not like we're all gonna die. This is Harper. Do you copy? Hunslet, can you get us aboard? No way, Sarge. Between the debris and the decaying orbit? Death trap. Damn it. At least those platforms are leaving us alone. They are designed for planetary quarantine. But Lethe has to remain operational. Low orbit is considered safe, but beyond that, it's, it's a dead zone. Cerberus will shut down everything attempting to go through, in both directions. Cerberus, huh? You seem to know a lot about it. I know everything about it. I'm Pioneer Station. That's my job. Yeah? You know why I decided to turn the Otago into scrap metal? I... I don't know. Systems failure, maybe? You saw the state of the station. Shit! There she goes! Fuck! Follow her down, Hunslet. No problem. Fireball 
people like that's hard to miss. done with the place. Martinez! It's good to see you, Sarge. Sergeant Martinez, is it... is your communication system working? It's online, but we're only picking up static. These colonies sure have a relay problem. But who's asking? Meet Deputy Administrator Hayes from Pioneer. Where's Captain Cochran? There's shit going down on that station like you wouldn't believe. Gone. The whole command staff's gone. You're it. Me? Uh, you made sergeant before I did. You've got seniority. Yeah, sure, but these are the captain's orders, as in the deathbed kind. So this shit's all yours, he insisted. If you want me, I'll be in the armory, seeing what survived the crash. Yeah, do that. I have a feeling we're gonna need it. Ace, you better come with me. Ah, damn. What do we do now? We don't know what is happening on the surface of this planet. McDonald's, my boss, he sure didn't. We have to get in contact with someone if we hope to get out of this mess. I hate to rain on your parade, but the Otago shithoused. Even if it wasn't, how do we get out past those Cerberus platforms? Well, they'll stop a ship, but not a signal. If we create our own relay, perhaps we could broadcast from low orbit, just in case a ship passes by. Do you want to create a sort of satellite? We're not a pirate radio station, Deputy Administrator. Or we could contact Pharaoh Spire. Director Price you needs heard, to- You heard, Martinez. The relays on this rock could be down for good. You want to send a message? Get out and start walking already. There has to be something we can do. Maybe there is. But I'm not seeing it. So you're gonna sit here and do nothing? Like hell. After what happened up there, regs are clear. We're on an alert footing. There could be a hostile biomorph loose on Lethe. So we've got civvies in danger and no way to contact them, right? What about Otago's short-range frequency receiver? Yeah, that could work. For now. That doesn't solve our broadcasting problem. We have to you warn the people. You find a way we can do that, then maybe, maybe we can talk about making that happen. Until then, we save everyone we can. We're Marines. That's the job. You want to help? Get familiar with this ship. What's left of it, anyway. Have a nice day, Deputy Administrator Hayes. I'm Administrator Hayes, I know. I don't want to seem unwelcoming, but I don't really have time to talk right now. A lot of Marines are hurting. Half my orderlies are dead, and the med base being held together with bailing tape. How many casualties are we looking at? Between the platforms and the crash? At 20. And that'll double before the day's out. There's another 10 unaccounted for in Hangar Bay 3, but the doors are decompression sealed, so we know how that'll go. It'll get worse still if I don't get back to it, so if you'll excuse me. Yes, sorry. Sorry. This one's a priority. Understood. Stay safe, okay? Hey, new girl. Sorry, but I'm pretty busy right now. The crash buckles have to support bulkheads. That's all I can do to stop this place caving in. All right, I'll let you get on. 
Thanks. Need a gun, administrator? Bye now. Administrator Hayes, I can't tell you how glad I am to see another Wayland yutani face aboard. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Dr. Becker. The company assigned me to the ship in order to oversee trials of a new cryo-sleep routine. But I can't see that happening now. Look at the state of my lab. Months of vital research gone. If I at least had power, I could salvage the backups. But these brutes keep ignoring me. Perhaps you could... Sorry, Doctor, but they're not exactly friendly to me either. It's not about friendly. Who holds higher authority? A Wayland yutani executive or your typical Marine? Where does half the USCM's funding come from? Who provides their weapons? Hmm? You might want to push them. I'm sure they'll back down. Thank you, Doctor. You've given me a lot to think about. Well, of course I have. Deputy Administrator Hayes to the bridge. Hayes, please report to the bridge. Have a nice day, Administrator. All right. This is what the short-range frequency receiver picked up. It's a distress message from a nearby colony. Oh no. You thinking what I'm thinking? We have to go there. See for ourselves. What? I feel for those people, but we're blind here. If we're to save anyone, we need proper comms. We got them. The Otago, Hunsut's dropship, our vehicles, my marines. They all speak the same language. Courtesy of the USCM comm system. That's not what it's I meant. It's a military decision, Hayes. Which means it's my decision. Those folks need help. Fine. What do you need from me? Well, normally I'd lay the squad and an officer would run oversight. You know, intel, tactical, from the ARC, our armored recon carrier. I can do that, but I need you to handle the rest from here on the Otago. Oh, I thought I was in the military. Don't I know it. Listen, if I'm going to keep my people alive, I need someone with smarts for when mine falls short. If it helps, this ain't exactly what I signed on for, either. Welcome to the Colonial Marines. Operations ready in the following areas. Understood. Uploading mission data. Marines, listen up. I know we're hurting, but we got us a go mission. We pulled in a partial signal from the settlement of Dead Hills. We don't know exactly what's happening there, but after what we've seen on Pioneer, we can't take any risks. We'll start by securing the landing control zone. From there, we'll take a look around, see what's going on. Keep your eyes open for survivors. Be ready for a firefight. Even a bad day can get worse.
Welcome to the New World Order. I'll be running tactical from the ARC, while Hayes runs support from the Otago. Administrator Hayes, are you settled in up there? I think so. This tech's old, but I can work with it. Well, don't let Corrigan hear you say that. Okay, standard recon. Get the perimeter gate open, and let's see what's going down in this burg. On it. Come on, team! Roger. Double time! Accessing terminal. Administrator, did we receive anything more from Sheriff Souza? Not a word. I don't like this. Roger that. Squad lead. Sounds like our first task is to secure the landing control zone. If things go south, fall back to the ARC and let the big guns do the talking. Do you hear? Door's locked. Run a bypass. Let's get in there. Copy. Right now! Granted. Come on, team! Hey, Harper. No sign of movement from up here. Do you see anything? Not a soul. Place is a real ghost town. Don't you worry, Nun Sarge. You've got a squad of big, strong... ...strong Marines to keep you safe. What have we got? Satellite communications access looks intact. Just more than can be said for the operator. No answers here. Looks like he killed himself. Guy must have hated his job. Don't we all? If you're done, how about getting me plugged in? Affirmative. Establishing satellite uplink. Stand by. Stand by. Stand by. Link established. Mm. Looks like someone put the colony on lockdown. You know how long it'll take to burn through every door in the complex? If you get to the township HQ, you should be able to shut off emergency status. That'll open up the doors. I can also scan for the settlers' personal data transmitters from there. Okay, squad. You heard the lady. Get this door unwelded and continue our path towards the colony headquarters. Cut that door open. Door opened. Come on, team. Double time. We're not getting through here. Looks like someone wasn't taking any chances. Squad lead, use C4 to clear the wreckage. Roger. Planting C4. Get down, it's gonna blow! Well, I don't know we're here now. You know what this reminds me of? We don't know it was those creatures. Could be an uprising, could be anything. Stay frosty, Marines. Come on, team! Double time! What the hell is that? Looks like some kind of skin. Did they not teach you about biohazards in the USCM? Don't touch it! You done? Good. Marines, 
There's something in here with us. It doesn't take a genius to guess at what. Stay sharp. Safe position taken! Guys, I have a bad feeling about that. Come on, you've watched too many movies. It was built by the way you. It'll hold. Get us upstairs. Right now. Get out of here, now! This frag nearly took us with it. We'll need another way out. Told you. Freaking told you. Come on, team. Hurry up, squad. You're at the HQ. You should be able to deactivate lockdown. Roger. Roger. Deactivating now. Let's hope this works. Okay, now let's check out the colonist's personal data transmitters. For that, I'll need the sector map. Go ahead and find it. Hey, I found something. Looks like a data pad. On it. Accessing terminal. What have we got, Hayes? I'm reading six, uh, no, seven signals with vitals. Wait. <laughs> One's right inside the room. Hey, you! In the locker! My trigger finger's itching. So come out. But come out friendly-like, yeah? Don't shoot! Don't shoot! I... I just don't feel so good. Calm down. We're not gonna hurt you. What happened here? It got me. It got me like the others. It got him? What does he mean? All right. Settle him down. Something... I had something on my face. And then... What the hell? She's fire! She's fire! Screw that! I'm out! He said something latched onto his face. I've seen that. It's what happened to McDonald and the others on Pioneer. I... I think these creatures use us as incubators. What the hell are you talking about? The creatures on Pioneer. The thing we just saw, they're the same. One gross than the other. The... That's probably why we found that skin down there. So we could be seeing a lot more of them here? How many? What's the population of Dead Hills? I'd start there and hope for better. Shit, man. I don't like that. Great. That's just great. Securing from emergency lockdown. In five, four, three, two, one. South door is open. Stay alert, Marines. These things can attack us from every direction now. Come on, team! Move, move! Those things got in. Squad lead, deploy a field spotter. 
I want to know if anything comes out of this hole. Deploying motion tracker. Motion tracker activated. Nice work, team. If something comes out of there, we'll get a reading. Now let's get back to those survivors. Move on! Hurry up, you slugs! Yeah, looks like the field spotters picked something up. Squad lead, check it out. Sweep it secure. There's something around. We're spotted! It's shut. Someone made the right call. Reading a personal transmit. Better on the other side. Could be a live one. All right, Marines. Get them out. Cut that door open. We're breaking the well. Are you with the company? Take it easy, man. We're the USCM Corps. I'm under the orders of Sergeant Harper and in contact with Administrator... Hayes from Pioneer Station. It's Joe McAllen, technician second grade. Please, don't leave me here, please. Technician? Chief Corrigan can probably use another pair of hands. No way he's getting in my dropship. How do you know he's not infected? Infested, Hunslet. These things are parasites, not a disease. Marines, you reckon we can trust him? I mean, he welded that door pretty tight to keep these guys at bay.
Just keep an eye on him, will you? Squad lead, bring him back to the ARC. But stay alert. I don't want any surprises. All right. Stay calm, Joe. We're getting you out of here. Stay with us. We'll get you back to our transport. Team, move, move! There's something around. Shh, here's one. Don't get too comfy, okay? On it! Move on! Come here to enjoy the view, so move now. Move on. Hurry up, squad. Hey, you passing the bar? Bring me back some of the good stuff. Thank you. I never thought I'd get out of there alive. Looks like the organ's gonna get that extra pair of hands.
So, hostile critters, a wiped out colony, Hunslet being Hunslet. How'd you find your first day in the Corps? I don't know. It's a lot to take in. If it helps, you're doing okay. Thank you. I'm glad it's over. My nerves are shot. Oh, it ain't never over. But for now, we got some time. Good. Gives me a chance to work on the comms. If only we could hear from Director Price and Pharaoh Spire. We could use her help. Dr. Becker's been trying the whole time we were deployed. It turns out most long-range transmitters are down. If someone's home at Pharos, they probably can't pick up. Do you think those things can be there too? Judging by what happened on Pioneer, it's clear that they're spreading extremely fast. Then you'd better get familiar with the Otago right now. We can't give those creatures the benefit of time. Have a nice day, Deputy Administrator Hayes. Ah, Administrator. I wanted to... Oh, going that badly, is it? I'll get back to you on that. Can I do something for you? Actually, yes. I was hoping you might persuade Sergeant Harper to retrieve some samples of the creatures. One can never have too much information about one's enemies. I didn't know you worked in corporate espionage, Doctor. <laughs> Very droll. On the other hand, I do find that science and skullduggery have a surprising overlap. Both require focus and a keen eye for detail. One supposes. True enough. And you're right. We need more information on these things. I'll talk to the sergeant. Stay safe out there. Chief Engineer Corrigan, isn't it? We met before. Oh, it's you. Sorry about that, I... You had your hands full. Things look better now. They are. Came together faster than I thought. Ain't pretty, but we're functional and, I hope, stable. Harper told me we got splashed after some kind of failure in the planetary quarantine protocols. Something called Cerberus? That's what's going around, certainly. More corporate corner cutting. What a fucking mess. Anyway, I should be able to produce equipment for our Marines now. Anything I can do to help? Well, I don't think this ship will ever be spaceworthy again. But that doesn't mean we have to abandon her. It could be shelter, you know? For these people. For us. The only problem is dear Otago took a beating. I got holes to patch. Cables to reconnect. Our cryo chambers, our shield, their history. In short, we're missing materials. Spare parts to turn into upgrades. For both our guys and the ship. Look, no promises. But we could ask the Marines to check for materials in Dead Hill's storehouses during their next visit. It all helps. Need a gun, Administrator? Bye now. Administrator Hayes, what brings you to my corner of the Otago? Sergeant Harper says I should take a look around. He's probably trying to keep me busy. Yeah, the devil loves idle hands. I can't give you a tour. We're still digging through the wreckage. How does it look? Well, we've more portable weapons than we've got Marines to carry them. So if you find anyone out there with training, you point them in my direction. As for the ordnance, it's pretty much scragged. What about the emergency escape vehicles? <laughs> that satellite relay idea of yours, huh? Yeah, Harper told me. If we can get the fuel linkages repaired, we might salvage one EEV. But I'd be damned before I let you play with the only life pod we have left. <laughs> 
And how useful is a single life pod on a crashed ship exactly? Yeah, you're pretty convincing. I'll give you that. All right, take it, but keep me updated. Looking for someone in particular? What did I teach you, Marine? Salute! You can count on them, man. Back from your tour? How'd it go? Pretty good, I think. Dr. Becker requested some samples of the creatures for study. And Chief Corrigan is in need of components to turn this ship into a proper base. I thought you were all about getting your message out. There's nothing to say we can't do the one so long as it doesn't endanger the other, is there? True enough. All right. Let's go back to Dead Hills. I have a feeling we missed something there. The same feeling you have when these creatures come around, Sergeant? This is hardly the moment, Deputy Administrator. Listen, Sergeant Harper. Your abilities, they could be tied to this outbreak. If there are more like you out there, it could help. People should know. They have the right to you know. You mind your own business, Hayes, and I'll take care of mine. You have a relay to find and I have men to lead. We both have a part to play. This conversation's over. New objectives are awaiting your review. Stay, Deputy Administrator Hayes. Stay safe. Hello, Hayes. Need a gun, Administrator? Administrator Hayes. Talk to you soon. Welcome, Administrator Hayes. What did I teach you, Marine? Salute. You can count on them, man. New objectives are awaiting your review. Have a nice day. Deputy Administrator Hayes. You can count on them, man. New objectives are awaiting your review. New objectives are awaiting your review. New objectives are awaiting your review. Have a nice day, Deputy Administrator Hayes.
What did I teach you, Marine? Salute. Bye, ma'am. Troops, at ease. Have a nice day, Deputy Administrator Hayes. Bye now. Hello, Administrator Hayes. Operations ready in the following areas. Understood. Uploading mission data.